So I have some impressions of Wulong, Fallen Dynasty. Okay, so I'm a bit of a Souls fan, but I'm really bad at playing. As in, like, I played every game apart from Sekiro from, from Software. Like, every Souls, like, from from Software, except for Sekiro. And I've tried a few others, and I always put tons of, hour into them, tons of hours into them and never finish them. And... I was just flicking through Game Pass on the PC and saw uh, Wulong Fallen Dynasty. And I think when it came out, I did give it a go, but I didn't really remember much I, other than great pain against the first boss. So I thought, you know what, let's give it another crack. And I'm glad I did. It's set in like the Three Kingdoms period, so we're fighting the Yellow Turban army and you start to meet... Um, characters from from the Romance of the Three Kingdoms and I'm about four hours in so far I've defeated about four four-ish bosses and I'm really enjoying it like it's like it's obviously Souls inspired but at the same time it's a lot more focused I feel on the, its own deflect mechanic which is kind of like it's your dodge but timing it perfectly to get the counter attack in which then reduces this gauge like the spirit gauge the enemy has which then allows you to do even more damage with big fancy attacks and it all combines into this really visually like awesome to look at combat sequences and adding on like that whole the whole romance of the three kingdoms which is something i've always loved love the whole chinese mythology and such especially when brought a lot to life in games it gives kind of like a real visual treat and this time around like i said the first time i didn't get very far i didn't put much time into it at all but this time i've really put in the effort in even though the bosses always kick my ass it's really fun <laughs> And I feel like I get it this time. I feel like I'm actually getting it. Um, there's a lot going on. Like, like I said, you've got this spirit stuff, which is so you know in in like games like this, there's usually a stamina mechanic, but in this game, it's a spirit mechanic. And as you hit things, your spirit bar goes up, and then you can use big attacks which reduces it. And if you reduce it too far, you kind of go into your own stunned mode. And everything is like about balancing that spirit mechanic, like pushing it into the positive or the negative. And then you get magic on top of that, which you also uses the spirit. You've got martial arts, which are like fancy techniques based on the weapon that you've got equipped. The leveling system was a little bit confusing. I must admit I had to read up exactly what it was. Like and I recommend, as everyone else does, wood to start to get your HP up. Always important in these games. So you don't die you also get partners straight away uh pretty much all through it you have someone with you and the ai is a bit dodgy but it's it's nice it's nice to always have that buddy there helping you out so yeah yeah it's uh i'm not sure if i sold it very well but i have to give the impression i'm, I'm actually enjoying wulong um Obviously, once I've finished it, I'll give my full opinions. See you soon.